Yeah, I'm in game mode. I got my game face. I'm ready to kill it. Cooking up everything inside skill. Yeah, toy, toy, three, zero. I'm gonna go off and kill some more shit. Even if it's a little bit more, but I don't give a fuck. I'm in game mode. Yeah, this is my game mode. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna talk my shit out like the guns for high life. Yeah, I'm gonna beat the shit out of the bosses like I'm a bad mutant. I muted my crap so much over the years. I'm not the same. Yeah, chameleon. Yeah, I gotta go build a crap. I'm sharing Minecraft. Yeah, I'm gonna bot that shit. Bitch, I'm in game mode. Watch it explode this shit. I'm gonna implode with the sickness. Yeah, I'm a victory of greatness. I'm in game mode. Game mode. Yeah, it's that game mode. Yeah, bitch, that game mode. Great ever do it like this what the fuck is up hey but this motherfucker seen crash Bree back into the videos back is bitch we're about to do yet another minecraft mod review so today we're going to be reviewing a mod that i've been wanting to review for a minute um it's called mystical agriculture now i've never heard about this mod before until recently and i started doing my research into it started diving into it because i obviously um, we got to get into it on Sky Factory at some point. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get into it on Sky Factory. But I had to, I had to do some research on it to kind of see what what this mod's all about. And uh, just like I suspected, um, it's basically like magical crops. Basically, it's like a redone version of magical crops. Basically, um, it's like it's like somebody took magical crops and uh, they basically replicated it. Um, so that being said, I'll show you guys real quick. So. Yeah, I spawned in a world. So basically, you spawn in a world, and uh, what you do is you kill uh, uh, zombies and shit. Like, you gotta kill zombies, for example, or skeletons. It doesn't really matter. Um, as long as you kill one or the other. But yeah, watch. Hold on. It, sh it should drop. I don't know if it will. Um, hold on. Let's see. Um, did it drop? No, it didn't. Um, but yeah, basically, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to kill the zombies, and they're supposed to drop uh, Inferium. And which is one of the base things in the mod that's going to be what you're going to need. So hold on. Um, let me go ahead and turn into creative mode real quick. Um, so game mode. Uh, see, I thought I thought it was going to work on, on, on killing the zombies, but I guess it doesn't. Um, or maybe it has like a low chance of spawning in. Maybe. I don't know. It could be. That could be the case. I don't know. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and... Uh, I'm gonna show you guys this. Okay, so Mag mystical agriculture. That's the name of the mod um, So basically it adds in these different seeds and in order to get these seeds you have to get Inferium So yeah, you're gonna have to get it and I think there's a way to get it. So you have to uh, You have to get it a certain way So you have to either do it by by killing a mob or you can find an ore I believe there's like an Inferium ore and Inferium ores they look just like this um, but yeah, they, they, they look just like that. You find them in the mines and everything. Um, and you find them in your world and everything. And once you're able to find those, um, you have to gather about eight of them, I think. And you gotta make, uh, the tier one crafting seeds, which basically you're gonna need a base, uh, a crafting seed, which in order to do, to get that, you need to get a thing called a prosperity shard. Now, I honestly don't know how to get these. Um, because like I said, I'm still very new to learning about this mod and everything and how it works and everything Um, but yeah, you have to get I think I think I think it's also you got to get this ore too I think you got to get this ore as well the prosperity ores. So you got to find prosperity ores, which th th that's what they look like Um, they spawn in your world. I don't know exactly where in this world But yeah, they they should be in your world and you just got to look around and find them and once you find them Um, you can find them and uh, yeah so basically you need to get inferior you need to get prosperity and inferium and once you get prosperity and inferium um you can basically make the tier one crafting seed so basically what these seeds do is they grow and uh just like in magical crops they grow for you just like the manicio um and all that other shit so yeah <laughs> which you guys can go back to that video of me doing the uh, magical crops mod review um for more uh context to it but yeah and also there's like different tools you can make with it um, there's so much stuff you can do in this mod like it's crazy. You can even make diamond F you, Dude, you can you can get diamond seeds on here like look so yeah You can you can make these different tier seeds, but you got to make these seeds and In order to actually make these other type of seeds. So yeah, there's like tier there's tiers of these seeds um, So basically you need about eight inferium and once you get eight inferium or you put that together and then you put that with with the seed and you get inferium seeds and basically um it goes from there so that's how you have to get started in this mod and then you get the tier two um you need to, you need to craft the tier two um that was a tier i think that was tier one so yeah there's different tiers of this um like tier three tier tier one tier two um tier four um it goes i think it only goes up to five yeah it only goes up to five 
Uh, but yeah, there's like five different tiers on here that you have to do and you have to level them up kind of like you do in uh, Magical Crops. So yeah, this is basically like a port of Magical Crops kind of, but it's redone. Um, it's, it's a little bit different. And then you get the, and then also you can make this Inferium uh, helmet, which basically you need to have Inferium cores, which in order to get Inferium cores, you need to have Inferium Essence and a lot of it. <laughs> You're going to need to have a lot of Inferium Essence in order to make this armor. But yeah, you can make Inferium uh, armor. You can make uh, uh, pr Prudentium, I think that's how you pronounce it, Prudentium? How you pronounce it? I don't know. Um, but yeah, you can make the next one, which basically is Prudentium, and Prudentium is basically, um, it's basically like Inferium, but it's different. Um, and then you also need to make Infusion, you also got to make an Infusion Crystal, which in order to do that, you need to have, uh, you have to have Inferium and Prosperity Shards and a Diamond. So you need to have a Diamond in order to make this, and uh, once you're able to make that, then it changes everything so yeah and there's also you can also make roll you can make watering cans on here out of Imperium. um you can make all these different art things and i don't know what the fuck that was in my mouth <laughs> um i think i, I think a bug flew in my mouth <laughs> but yeah anyway without further ado um yeah and they can also make uh intermedium and uh yeah so intermedium is i think is the next step after uh pen i can't even pronounce that it's per produnium i think I, I think that's how you pronounce it produnium I don't even know. <laughs> um, but yeah, and then you get an intermedium, which basically how you get that is you have to make, uh, you have to infuse all this together. So it's just like magical crops. Um, but it, this is different though. It's different because it adds in way more stuff and it gets complex a little bit. <laughs> I even had to, I even had to research some of this. But yeah, and you could also make uh, the, the inferium swords. You can make the pundonium swords. And they can also make, uh, and then you also need to get, and you have to get, uh, sir, uh, so I think the highest level you can go on here is the, uh, Superium, which basically the Superium is like the best, the best of the best. So basically you start off with Inferium and then you go all from there all the way to, uh, Superium. And then, um, yeah, and then you also got, uh, Superium and then you got, uh, yeah, I think that's, uh, I, yeah, dude, this mod, it gives me a headache a little bit, but hey, it is what it is, but. Yeah, it's basically like a port of yeah. So here, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually try on this armor because I don't think I ever tried it on in this mod. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Um, yeah. So basically, that's what the inferior armor looks like. I mean, it's a, it's a nice little yellow to it. I mean, it's all right. It's all right. It's a night mod or, or night like set of armor. But yeah, and then there's also uh, let's see, and there's also perundium armor, which basically is green. Um, and then, yeah, let's put that, let's put that on, there we go, okay, there we go. So yeah, that's the Pedunium armor, and then you also have the, uh, next arm, the next, uh, set of armor, which is Intermedium. Um, I'm gonna put that on, and also you can make the different, uh, the different, yeah, and same thing with the, with the armor, you can make the different, uh, tools with it, like, you can make, like, you know how you can make wooden axes, wooden pickaxes, and all that. Well, you can do the same thing with this, so yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, you can basically do that same exact thing with this. So yeah, you can make intermediate pickaxes and sur and superior pickaxes and shit. Um, but yeah, and 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 also I think there's also a I think I think eventually you can get a fly on here too. So you can get like a fly effect and put on there. Um, but yeah, look see look it says charm slot empty. So basically it is kind of like uh, uh, magical crops because magical crops you can craft these different gems or whatever. I think that's what it's called. Um, I think it's like a yeah, it's like a it's like a charm. Well, I think it was like a gem or something. But you put that gem on your armor in magical crops, and uh, you can actually fly and shit with it. And I don't I don't know if I even went through that on there, but maybe I did. I don't remember. Um, but yeah. So that being said, there's a lot to this. I'm not gonna be able to go through everything on here. Um, but magical agriculture is a huge mod. You guys can explore it for yourselves. Um, but yeah, and look at that. Look at that superior. Look at that dude. The fucking superior, the superior armor, I think is my favorite. I think it, I think it is, cause it's like the the highest tier that you can get to, and you have to go through a lot to get that, just to get superior. Like, look at this. Hold on, let me see. Is there a way to craft superior? Let's see. Um, I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna look it up. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's let's take a look and see what you need to get a superior. Um, superior. So yeah, you basically need to get, uh, I think it's called Supremium. No, that's called Supremium. That's Superium. Okay, so I got those two kind of mixed up. Um, so, Sur Supremium is that one, and then, uh, and then, uh, 
Yeah, and, and Super Em. I think that's what it's called. Maybe I don't know, dude. They're they're dude. They got different. They got different meanings for these different fucking dude. Yeah, they, they, it's just like this. This mod's huge. This mod's huge. It actually overwhelms me how big this mod is. Like it's basically like they took magical crops and they just fucking redid it. That's basically what this is. Um, but yeah, it's crazy though. And there's different charms you can make. Um, I think these are the different cores you can make and the different charms. Um, but yeah, there's a whole lot of these different charms you can make. Um, and in order to make a charm, you basically got to get a block of superior essence, which basically, um, you have to get blocks of intermedium and then you got to, and then in order to get that, you need to put that with that. And then you get the blocks of intermedium and then you can get, uh, the, yeah. So basically you just got to get these. Yeah, you gotta you gotta start off with Inferium because if you don't get Inferium, you cannot get into this mod. You can't progress through it. So yeah, Inferium is like the like the main thing you gotta get along with the uh, Prosperity Ores. You need to get Inferium and Prosperity Ores in order to actually start to get into this mod and actually are able to get into uh, what you're able to get into on here. So yeah, and like I said, you can craft different seeds. Like the diamond seeds, I'm gonna see. How, let's see, how do you craft diamond seeds? Um, so you're gonna need to have a uh, supremium. You're gonna have to have the supremium uh, essence, and in order to make the supremium essence, I just showed you guys. Um, you just have to, you have to reduce the the. You have to basically infuse it with the uh, sup the supremium. I think that's what it's called to get supremium. Um, but yeah, it's crazy though, dude. This mod is insane. <laughs> Now you, now you guys kind of see why I had to go through and uh, do my research on it. But yeah, and there's also different uh, little things you can make for the mod. Like there's different blocks and yeah, it's just huge though. I'm like I said, I can't go through all this, but hey, at least I went through the majority of it. So yeah, and you can also make a thing called a solium. Uh, you can make solium ingots, which I think those are made by, yeah, you have to make a, you have to make a thing called uh, solium dust. In order to make solium dust, you need to have uh, perdunium, and you also need to have soul dust. Which, in order to get soul dust, you need to have soul stone. In order to make soul stone, you need to have uh, you have to basically put soul sand with stone, and then you're able to get that. So, yeah, it's pretty insane. And then you can also get, uh, yeah, it's crazy, dude. This mod is insane. Like, just the aspects alone of it blow me away. <laughs> Um, and yeah, and there's also different, you can also make like with the golden apples, um, you can make the different, uh, you can make inferior apples or perdunium apples, intermedium apples. So uh, super, super, or uh, I think it's called superium apples and superium apples, which each I think have different effects. Yeah. Look at that. See, look at that. So you get absorption for the inferior one, then speed. If you do the perdunium and then the uh, intermedium, you get resistance. Um, and then the superium, you get regeneration. And then the last one which is supremium uh you get i think you get strength two yeah strength two and then also you can make the different coal um you can make different coals out of them so yeah and that's how you make different coals out of them um they burn they burn a lot faster i think they burn uh yeah i think they i think they burn for longer honestly i think that's what they do um and supremium coal obviously burns the longest because it's like the best material there uh, but yeah, and then you can also make these different watering cans, which is good for like uh, if you want to actually start a really good farm on here. Um, you can actually make these different watering cans, and I think each one of them is different. So yeah, look at that. See, look, the different range it goes up. So the the inferior one only goes one by one. So one by one area. Um, the perdunium goes by goes to a three by three area. The intermedium goes to a five by five area. The uh, the supreme or the superium goes uh, seven seven by seven, and then the supremium does the nine the nine by nine. <laughs> um, yeah, so a mouthful of words, but hey, it is what it is. Um, you can also get these little experience droplets, which in order to make those, you basically put the experience ingots or not experience. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, like I said, this mod is so fucking big. I can't go through everything on here, but. Hey, at least I showed you guys the majority of it, so you guys can basically go and experiment with this mod as well for yourselves. Um, like I said, I've never really got into this mod, but I had to go into it 
today because I'm going to be going into it on Sky Factory and try to go into it on Sky Factory at least. Um, but, but yeah, I've been stuck on this mod. I've been stuck on trying to figure out how to do this mod for a minute. Um, so that's why I haven't really been doing Sky Factory lately. I'm thinking about doing another Sky Factory video tomorrow. So um, yeah, tune in, tune in for that. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's all I got to say for this video. If you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like down below. If you guys are new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. Let's keep on channel up. Let's keep on doing this. Let's try to get to that 150 subscribers by your boy. I know we can do it. We just got to keep on doing the videos. We just got to keep on running the channel up like we've been doing on here. And uh, yeah, that's all I got to say for this video. Just about focusing Christ. I know. And I'll see you guys on the next Minecraft mod review.